Okay. There's going to be a, a lot of activity, a lot of people, a lot of excitement. <laughs> I woke up a few times last, last night, you know, thinking, what are we going to do here? What are we going to do there? And, you know, and, uh, you know, the veterinarians from Mexico are also coming. Mm -hmm. And I think people from uh, uh, wildlife services will be there as well. Um, because you work on different animals, you never really know exactly what you're going to see. So you make use of the knowledge that you've uh, accumulated over the years. You make use of that to make a decision on the spur of the moment. Because like for instance the surgical root canal that we're going to anticipate doing today, I don't know if it's ever been done on a, on a Jaguar. Glenn? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Probably not. So that happens. So you just have to make use of your knowledge that you've accumulated over the years and, and, and apply that to what we're going to do today. It's always exciting when we go there. And, uh, you know, it's usually a big thing because there's a lot of people involved in the, in the zoo and, and, and we always want to promote things for the zoo so that uh, people realize what, what a zoo is all about. I know you and I talked about that. Mm -hmm. You know, one of the things I thought about the other day when, when you and I talked, I thought, you know, you asked me why do I do all these things. I think, you know, Glenn, Glenn is also from South Africa and I think as, as immigrants, we're very grateful to live in America. Mm -hmm. And I think to do something back and give something back for nothing uh, is, 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 is really something I like to do and uh, you know share my knowledge and we, we we educate a lot of veterinarians a lot of technicians you know about veterinary dentistry and I think that all of that sort of feel I'm giving something back without getting paid for it and in a way it's more rewarding than even if I was paid for it <laughs>